2020 signals a new era in Wilson football history. Former Blue Knights head coach Manoso Rogers was named the new head coach of Wilson back in March, and thus the new era begins. What do you uh, give me your thoughts on that on that uh, coaching hire? That's gonna be. I think it's gonna be a totally different culture going on. Mm-hmm. Um, shout out to Coach Buck Martin when he was there. You know, yep. he was a Wilson alum, <clears throat> and he was already on Wilson's former staff with Coach Fleming. Rest in peace to Coach Fleming. Yep. So it's it's gonna be a different change in you know everything, how everything is ran, mm-hmm. terminology, you know, those type of things are different. And maybe COVID is helping. Maybe it's not. Mm-hmm. You know, especially when you talk about what time to get back to work out and things like right, that. Right. Right. So. It, I think overall it's going to be a different experience. You know, Coach Rogers, he has no situation where year one they win state championship. So, yep. <laughs> championship experience. You know, that first year blue, he won a state championship, beat friendship, a loaded friendship team. So, yes. if he does that again, you know, maybe I want to hire Coach Rogers. Because <laughs> he's that first year coach, you know. Right, right, right. And also, like, like I said, um, you don't know what's the offense going to be, what's the defense going to be. Sure. I didn't hear some talks as. Talk about some crazy offense. I'm not going to say right now, right, but right, right. heard some crazy things. And if that happens, you know, who's going to be prepared for it? That's true. You know, it's not a 7 on 7. There's no time for us to really, like, for even teams just to know until you step on that field. Right, right. Especially because I don't think. Um, we don't even know we're going to have scrimmages. Right. Or 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 um, non-D games or you anything know, this, like that. A lot of, it's still a lot of questions. In my opinion, this might go, you might have. Well, I think they said three non-league games. Well, three, yeah, three non-league games. Mm-hmm. They might make you play like a crossover thing. You might have to play in stripes. That's true. That's so true. you never know how this is going to go. Right, right. Um, and let's say everything for Wilson does click. Let's, mm-hmm. just, let's just hypothetically. If they are a win-now-ready team, because um, to be honest, I'll be honest, my opinion, I think they're in maybe not a total rebuild, but at least a mid-level rebuild. Okay. rebuild. I'll, be, I'll be honest to say that. Um, but let's hypothetically, let's say they are winning now already. Let's say they hit the ground running come season, come uh, February. Defensive end Sean McPhail will be not just a, but the impact player on that Wilson Tigers team. Coming off a 17-sack season and a 9-sack season the year before in 2018 and then a 17-sack season last year in 2019. I expect him to have another 15 plus sack season, um, if not eclipse 20, um, maybe and lead the league 20. in sacks. Ooh. Coach Rob Lee, I know he's gonna bring that, you know, that the real style <laughs> there. That's we get 20 sacks. That's different. Yeah, that's big dog status. Um, and for him, um, coming off the edge, like he's so fast. Just watching his tape, so he does fast. That, that's, that's great. Yeah, you know he is fast coming off the edge. You know, like he beats speed, the tackle literally at the snap. Speed rusher style. Um, but one thing I did, uh, in addition to how well he rushed the passer, he really improved against the run. And that's one thing that I wanted to see because I spoke about him last year's, last year's preview. I wanted to see how well he would um, play the run, play play against the run as a defensive end. And he did pretty well, I, showing that he's an all-around yeah. defensive end outside linebacker. I got a question for you. Sure. When you look at, you know, D.C. football, and I'm not talking about as a whole, like, 15 years ago. I'm talking about, like, now. <laughs> yeah. When you look at it, do you – See this more as a run or a pass? Um, when you see like offensive runs. Um I would say more pass. More pass. I would say more pass. Um then you have the teams that are, you know, they they're gonna be run heavy. Um like come like you said not like fifteen, ten, fifteen years ago, but four or five years ago, first when it comes to run heavy bail, first thing you think of. Yeah. Um, you have some teams that Bill can do it all. Made, Bill made me want to go play running back. I know, right? <laughs> Bill made me want to play running back for real. Um, but like I said, I think Wilson is in a maybe a mid-level rebuild. But only again, kind of like we said about HD, only time is going to tell for the Tigers. 